all right? I am perfect. You are. You know what, Mac? I, I need to discuss something with you. Uh, he's helping me with an investigation. Oh, Uncle Mac, does Felicia know that you're moonlighting as an investigator? She does, and she's all in. Okay. Listen, when you're settled, I want to hear everything, okay? Yes, you will. Yes, I promise. Love mm -hmm. you. Love you. <laughs> I mean, I know that it's all over, and I know that I'm safe, but I just, it doesn't feel real until I get a hug from my Uncle Mac. Yeah. How about one from me? Yeah. <laughs> oh. Hey. I didn't, I didn't think you were here. Robin. Hi. Hi, Sam. <laughs> Wow, I, I would not have just walked in like that, but I thought you were on an indefinite leave of absence. That's what the hospital said, and Danny made you an ornament for Christmas and wanted to drop it off. It's very sweet of him. Uh, yeah, the situation resolved itself a little sooner than expected. Well, that, that's good news, right? Does that mean you and Robin are back together? Elizabeth! Hi. Hi. <laughs> what are you doing here? I thought you were in Paris. It's complicated. Do you have a moment? Yeah, of course. Yeah. Well, first and foremost, I just wanted to tell you I'm so happy for you <laughs> that you got Jake back. Oh. And just how unspeakably cruel what Helena did to you. Yeah, I, thank you. I try not to dwell on it. The important thing is that We've got Jake back. You and Jason. Patrick told me that you were engaged. Yeah, uh, not, not anymore. Does that mean Jason broke our engagement when he found out I knew who he was and lied about it? Oh, well, why did you do that? I mean, how, how could you do that to Jason? For my family to grieve for me when I wasn't dead. I mean, I can only imagine what Jason's family is going through. And you're wondering how I could do that to Sam, Danny, Monica, Carly, Sonny. Well, yes. <sighs> Robin, I lied because when I first knew him, I, he, he was Jake Doe. He was a man without a past. And when he was discharged from the hospital, he didn't have a place to go, so I took him in. And I fell in love with him. And when I found out he was Jason, I knew it was going to happen. I knew that Carly was going to drag him back into his old life, right back to Sam, because she's the only woman who could tolerate Carly. And I didn't want that. So yeah, I lied. I lied to keep him with me, to protect the family that I wanted to have with him and my boys. And I know it was selfish and it was unfair, but you know what? I'd do it again. So go ahead. Have at me. Everybody else has. You can give me all the reasons why I should be punished. Oh, no, I, <laughs> I'm not here to judge you. I mean, obviously you're... <sighs> you're punishing yourself. the last person I should be unloading on. I just can't imagine what that would have been like, falling in love with Jason, not knowing it was him. You probably think you would have recognized him, but no one did. Is he very different? Well, his face is, but in other ways, he's exactly the same. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I didn't realize anybody was up here. I'll leave you in peace. Hey, hey, wait. Are you Robin? Jason? On the next General Hospital. You are no fool. I don't trust my mom. She's dangerous, even more so now. What's gonna happen with you and Dante? Did you get it or not? How could you screw my mother over? What are you doing here? I'm so happy that you're alive. 